It's a four year work session. And the person you walk in as is not the person you walk out as. Out as, out as, out as, out as, Don't, 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 don't bother me. I'm working. 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 Don't bother me. Working, working. Let me. I'm working. Don't bother me. Don't bother me, can't you see? Don't bother me, working, working. Let me, I'm working. Uh, don't bother me. Don't, don't, don't bother me, can't you see? I just read an article the other day. It was talking about the top musical theater schools in the country, and we're tier one now. And that's, I mean, that's, that's a big deal. We're up there with the big ones, and that makes us a big one. That's kind of neat. <laughs> Most of us that were coming into the school were all big fish in little ponds when we left high school. You get to be W and all of a sudden you're a fish in a sea. It was about getting you to say, yes, let's try. And that's one of my favorite things about my training from Baldwin Wallace was that it really prepared me to be able to come in here and just play and just try. Having a degree in music allowed me to kind of never truly think about the music and all of my brain power when I'm on stage is going to acting because the notes, the rhythm, vocal placement, all of that was beaten into me so well at Baldwin Walls that I don't have to think about it anymore. You're working those muscles of not just being a good performer, but a good creator, a good um, innovator, and uh, just kind of a more well-rounded creative force in the theater environment. Uh, my music degree has come to my rescue quite often, mainly because uh, we learn to sight sing so well. So when you're working on a new show, oftentimes they do what's called a 29 hour reading. So you get 29 hours, not even, to get an entire musical under your belt, to feel comfortable with it, enough to put it on its feet by Friday. Uh, and this is probably starting on a Monday. But a lot of times you're not handed things until you walk in the room. And uh, it's, my music degree is, has helped me tremendously as far as sight reading and uh, understanding harmonies. Also just even just the general arc of what a song needs to be, what story it needs to tell, all of those things come into use, I would say, quite frequently. I could explore and not be berated for trying something new. I could feel like I could make a choice and it may not be the correct choice for me at that moment, but I could still make it and figure it out. I know how to do the classic legit, I know how to do the pop rock, I know how to do 80s stuff, I know how to do the contemporary. I feel like I have all the tools that make it possible that, that it doesn't scare me. Without BW, I wouldn't be where I am today. Not at all. They totally made it happen. They made me happen. They made who I am today as a performer happen. Yeah, if I didn't have BW, I wouldn't be where I am. And I'm so happy I'm here. I'm so happy. It's also been superbly helpful. Um, when you have to learn, like when I came into Big Fish, I had two weeks to learn the entire show. And that's everything, music, choreography, um, staging, whatever. And everyone else knew it. I was the only new person. The, the day I came in to rehearsal, they were like, oh my god, you, you know everything already? And I was like, well, yeah. Like I sat and I learned the music at least. That's the one thing I could learn, you know what I mean? So then all I had to worry about was the choreography and the staging and, and the acting of it. I had never heard of solfege before. <laughs> I had never heard of like you know, ear training. Um, I, had taken, I had taken a little bit of piano before I got there, but um, I would say the fact that I can read music now and the fact that you know when we're in a music rehearsal, 
Ryan. And she actually and, knows what's going on. And I know what's going on. <laughs> I have to, like, I have to say, a, I'm very impressed. That is something <laughs> I honestly, before I went to BW, I, I was like, oh, I'll be able to fake my way through it. And like now I know and I understand and I have an appreciation for it. And um, that is something I never thought would happen before going to Paul yeah. So I'll That's that really sure. cool. It's so freeing, right? Because once you, yeah. the music is such an afterthought, sometimes you can just put so many different layers and mm -hmm. the acting comes naturally. And yeah. mm -hmm. you can think about everything but the music. Which yeah. is, Helpful. Mm -hmm. yeah. A huge part of what brought me here and I think what made me successful and what made me uh, see a lot of work was the fact that I knew that it was a business. The, the faculty and just the way classes are run and the way rehearsals are run. Um, it really gets you in that mindset, first and foremost, to think this is a business, this is a career, this is how I'm going to make my living. And raw talent is one thing, but if you don't have it put together, then this business is not going to take notice. There's a fine line between what I'm supposed to show you and who I really am. I think the thing I'm most thankful for Vicky and BW is the foundation she gave us, because as you can see, like I am not a Broadway star, and BW just doesn't train you to be a Broadway star. Like, I have these guys because of the foundation that Vicky gave me. We can do on camera, we can do on stage, we can do voiceover. BW kids can do it all, <laughs> truly. I was in the right mindset leaving school. I wasn't scared, I wasn't, I didn't feel unprepared, and I didn't, feel like there was some big chunk of knowledge that I was missing because that's the thing is it, it BW is a very well-rounded curriculum. So when people ask me one of the most valuable things that, that I got out of school, of course I got amazing training and technique, but one of the most valuable things connections that I got from Baldwin Wallace was the people who came in every single weekend and we got to audition for so that by the time I moved to New York I knew everyone in the industry I knew casting directors I knew agents so the fact that you have these master classes and you have to sing for people who are professionals in New York City because they actually are helping you and they're letting you know don't do this do this you shouldn't have sung that song you probably I love that song you should sing this you should definitely sing that for a 16 cut a 32 cut that that's extremely helpful. So not only did we learn about them, but when they came and we saw them face to face, we were so excited. And then on top of that, just so in awe that we get a chance to be with the people that are making things happen, that are doing the casting, that are the writers of shows. And that's so valuable in your first couple auditions in the city when you have those nerves and you're not sure what you're walking into. And PW kind of takes that away. The theater scene in Cleveland is so great. Playhouse Square, it's the second largest theater district next to Broadway, like in the heart of Cleveland. Baldwin Wallace has already teamed up with them. They've teamed up with regional theaters, the Beck Center. I, I had an entire mini theater career before I even got to New York, which is so insane that I got the college process, college shows, but also regional shows. They knew I knew what I was doing. They knew they could trust me. They knew that they didn't have to worry about a college kid coming in. They were like, oh, she's from BW? Great, send her, like, she's fine. Um, I'm very thankful for the work ethic that it instilled in me mm -hmm. because I would not be where I am today. I'm director proof. Because of, <laughs> because of Baldwin Wallace. You've got to be ready to work. You can't be lazy. And you've got to have a passion for this. You've got to want it. Um, it's an incredible learning environment. And the more open you are, the more you will learn and the better performer you will be when you leave that school. Raise her to the light. 
I swear to you, I will be there. The love. You know, at the end of the day, these teachers all love their students. And they pushed us and they, BW is the reason that I am here. And BW allowed me to find the confidence and the love for theater within myself. And I think that's what's great about this program. This program, it's selfless. I can truly say that the teachers and the faculty at this program and my classmates all supported me and they pushed me and in the end I was able to do right. You know, I graduated and I, I'm here. So I'm very grateful to the program and to all the friends, to my classmates.